Good afternoon, and welcome to Cornelia TV Presents. This is the second parable in my series of the parables of play people. And this story is called The Monster Unleashed. Through life was born two sons. Temper Temper and Goody Two Shoes. They were natural born opposites, so they were not twins, or were they? Anyway, one brother would knock you out if his mother told him to, or not, and the other brother would kill him with kindness, and that brought him joy which irritated his brother, and that brought out rage, which is the name of the unleashed monster within. Goody Two-Shoes beat Temper Temper in their last competition. Ball said, learn to be a good loser and try harder next time. The mastermind of evil seized the opportunity. Rage took over the mind of Temper Temper, and Goody was eliminated. When Boss confronted Temper Temper, Temper was sorry rage took over his mind, and he begged for his forgiveness, and that was granted, but he was sent away to another side of the world. More monsters were born. What will you do to end the competition? Or win it? Join me every day on YouTube. And we'll have a good time together. This story came from my book of wisdom for everyday people. Such as myself. For infinity and beyond. Take care, everyone. This is Parable 3, The Rainbow in the Sky, written by Cornelia Moss Odom. Today's story is about the sacred rainbow in the sky, formed eons ago. Fed up with watching the clay people destroy each other with corruption and evil through sin, God had decided the world was to be destroyed by a giant flood the world would never see. Lately, we've come close. Noah and his family were the only survivors left on earth because Noah had divine instructions to build an ark. Now the mastermind of evil and the pride monster grew in the minds of the people, which brought about rebellion they became monsters and they ridiculed Noah's family with stupid jokes. But when the animals started to board the boat and the door was closed, Noah got the last laugh. At the time, I'm sure it wasn't funny. God promised he would never destroy the earth again with water. And he formed a rainbow in the sky to remind us of his promise to Noah. Pride still packs a dangerous punch when used incorrectly. Today's world is full of examples. Climate change, me and one of them. Crime and corruption will always seal the deal of fate. Be careful and mindful of the truths given to us as a guide. I'm just saying. Thank you for tuning in to today's story, and I hope you enjoy the rest of your day. Live peacefully. Peace. Okay. Please don't. Okay? Love y'all dearly, but don't do it. <laughs>